Northwestern will try to keep their magical season going into the second weekend of the NCAA tournament, but they will face a big test this afternoon in Utah. CBS 2's Lauren Victory is live in Evanston with a preview for us today, a Northwest alum herself. Hi, Lauren. Good morning, Marissa. Well, it's a little quiet here in Evanston in part because it's 5 a.m., but also because students just started spring break. Regardless, we know that that wildcat roar will be heard around the world. More on that in a second. Now, if you haven't heard, Northwestern men's basketball made history twice this week. It's their first time making it into the NCAA tournament, and they won their first game against Vanderbilt. Game two is today against number one seed Gonzaga. Now, nobody doubts that's going to be a tough matchup. Players old and new are just thankful to be part of the big dance. It made me feel what I thought for many years when I was there that Northwestern could be on the par, uh, on the same level as a uh, Duke, a uh, Stanford, a mm -hmm. uh, Vanderbilt, some of the academic schools. I, I don't think, you know, we're, we're playing with any type of pressure. Um, you know, we're just trying to, you know, figure out what the game plan would be and, you know, go out there and play hard, see what happens. Now, the city of Evanston is hosting three official watch parties at the Gibbs Morrison Cultural Center, Chandler Newberger Community Center, and the Robert Crown Center. An email to alums, to me, shows that there are nearly 30 official watch parties elsewhere, stretching across the U.S. to Seattle, all the way across the ocean to the U.K. Game time is at 4.15 Central Time. That's the very latest. I'm Lauren Victor reporting live in Evanston. Marissa, back to you. All right, Lauren, go Cats. Thank you very much. And keep it right here on CBS. CBS 2 later this morning, Notre Dame takes on fourth seed West Virginia in the second round at 11 a.m. After that, Wisconsin and number one seed Villanova, also the defending champs. And then it is purple party time with Northwestern facing top seed Gonzaga at four and St. Mary's against second seed Arizona.